Welcome to Marvelicious Toys. We bring you news and reviews of Marvel toys, statues, and more. Because not all Marvel collections can be bagged and boarded. They're not just toys, they're Marvelicious. Dates for these were going to be in June, July. It looks like they've been pushed back to August, but we may be getting three waves of Legends in August all at once. Ay, ay, ay. Now, the first wave is the X-Men wave that we were kind of teased last year and saw at Toy Fair. And the hit of that wave is probably going to be Deadpool. But be prepared for a hard hunt as there's eight figures in this wave and that's one case. So there's not going to be two Deadpools to a case. Yeah, if you're going to want more than one Deadpool like me, it's going to be, like you said, some hunting or hoping that they ship this plenty. But, oh, the last time we had an X-Men wave, I don't know if it was a combination of X-Men being popular or the fact that it was a low run and only made available at Toys R Us. And online, strangely. Yeah, that combination kind of scares me about how out in the wild any of this wave is going to be to find. It's going to be rough unless they really make a lot. And the fact that they're doing three waves, boom, 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 makes me fear they won't. Because this wave has already sold out at most online resellers. And there's rumors that some that still have it up for order may be taking orders and not able to fulfill all of them. I placed the order literally within an hour of them going up online. Because I didn't want to mess up. And I ordered two cases for myself. (laughs) Not that I necessarily need to troop build these figures. But longtime listeners know I don't always have the best of luck with paint apps. Yeah, but now you've just ensured that this will be in stores all the time. So you're welcome, everybody. At least I got them at case cost versus trying to get Deadpool. The places that were selling individual figures... Deadpool gone immediately. Oh, definitely. I'm I'm excited that we have a new Deadpool sculpt. I'm a little, I mean, we've known this since last year that it wasn't going to be movie accurate, but it's exciting to be getting another new Deadpool, which is just packed with accessories. I mean, he's got swords, guns, big guns, bigger guns, a knife. He's got <laughs> his bazooka. <laughs> his charred head. Yeah, his alternate head. Oh, and doesn't look like, does he come with the Build-A-Figure piece? He might be the one without one. He does not. He is, he's got so many accessories, he doesn't get a big piece of Juggernaut. All right, Hasbro, start now planning on making solid cases of Deadpool. You won't be able to keep them in stock. Seriously, and now maybe some of the heat will go off those old Deadpool Toys R Us 2 packs that have been crazy expensive on eBay, too. So if you need your Warpath, maybe this will make it somewhat more affordable? Yeah, maybe. Because the only other time they came out with Warpath, he was in that hard-to-find San Diego exclusive X-Force pack. Uh, But I'm I'm loving this wave. I mean, yes, another Wolverine, but it's looking pretty sweet. And you get two different sets of hands for him, so you can have claws in or out. Oh, then we've got Deadpool. We've got the Rogue. Finally, it's a mate good. Well, it's not the rogue they showed us before. It's not the green outfit rogue. It is a classic 80s rogue, kind of like the animated series. Gotta see her in person for a review. I'm not all that impressed with the face. The outfit looks good. Then Kitty Pride, that might be the kind of the whatever of this wave. But it looks like she might be coming with the Magneto head for that onslaught. Mm-hmm. And a Juggernaut piece. So a lot of various accessories with her i'm also a little eh on the face there but i mean she comes with lockheed that's the best part (laughs) (laughs) oh and then cable nice upgrade to cable to a figure that we haven't seen since i think it's if it was hasbro it's been the early days but i think it's toy biz since the last time we've seen cable i don't own any cable legends i'm excited and then Iceman. Let's hope they do a better paint job. What is this, the <laughs> third Iceman now? <laughs> Maybe you guys are just too fussy. This one looks like it's got a little bit of more blue than, than white going on in it, so... It's spiky Iceman, so I'm happy it's not just a reuse of the sculpt. Very true. Phoenix is the one I'm excited for as far as the females of this wave. The green Phoenix outfit. 
I'm really hoping Walmart gets a Red Phoenix exclusive. Yeah, and it's looking like a new head sculpt too, so that should be pretty cool. And then Havoc, you know, he's going to be your standard comic version type of guy in this this wave, but still looks pretty cool. It's modern Havoc. But guess what has me most excited about this wave? Look how fresh this package looks in yellow. Weren't we just talking about that? It looks amazing in yellow. And I really am liking like the Captain America one they've got there now that's kind of similar packaging, but it doesn't pop on the shelf. This is going to pop. This just feels like a fresh breeze of toy newness on the shelves. It does really capture my eye. It's, you know, the same package they've already used, but the new colors give it such a fresh look. And not for nothing, but since the, there's no movie tie-in going on here, there's something nice about the entire line having the same X-Men logo throughout. Without, you know, like, oh, and here's the X-Men movie logo for this figure. Mm-hmm. Good point. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to that wave. Yeah, a lot of people are too. Dorkside Toys sold out, pre-sold out of the case, pre-sold out of all the figures, even Wolverine. Oh boy. Thanks for watching this video. You can see full episodes of Marvelicious Toys with more collecting news and reviews at MarveliciousToys.com. We also have thousands of toy and collectible photos in our photo gallery. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Until next time, make mine marvelicious.